taking it on. Probably playing for bulk colour this time. Not quite there. And he left a red. Certainly left a one to right corner, the black pocket. Can Ronnie get through to one in bulk? Well, even though he didn't pop the initial red, I thought he queued it quite well. Good queuing required with this as well. was the perfect settler on a big occasion like this. Struck with authority. Eight. A little piece about break building or myself and Stephen talking about we're gonna it'll be interesting to see just how he tackles this little situation. Still four possibly five loose reds. No. Deftest of little soft screw shots here just to hold the red. See that? Just holding the red beautifully. Sixty. Seventh. Four. Two five. As long as he goes into the right half of the pack here, if he goes into the pack, he should have you know, the one in bulk as a uh, in the back of them. He's definitely on one to right middle. This looks okay. 32. Normally, he would fully exploit a chance like this. It's eight. So late in the final of the inaugural tour championship isn't normal, though. But there's nothing gets his juices flowing more than sizable contributions. Fluent snooker. That's O'Sullivan's competitive lifeblood, even though he's a Forty. fine safety player. This is where he really excels. Forty two. Nine. Fifth. Fifty seven. Fifty-eight. 
Just a handful of pots away from securing this opening frame of the evening. Sixty five. Sixty six. That's pretty much frame ball. Now he's targeting a century to send a message. Seventy-four. How good a break builder is Ronnie O'Sullivan? Well, if he makes a century here, it would be the tenth time Eight. he's made two or more centuries in a match against Robertson. Eighty-eight. Ninety-four. The opening statement then of this final session. This is Sullivan's 60th century of the season, and he's only played in 10 tournaments. 111. The vast majority of the rank and file members of the tour would just love to make 60, playing everything, everywhere. 160. Sullivan says, I might have wobbled this afternoon, but not now. 